Hey folks, welcome to our musky segment. As I put the uh, finishing touches on sharpening this hook, I want to talk quickly about the subject of today's segment, and that is wind direction, wind angles, and how musky set up on points and, and reefs. Let's just take a look at this little reef this, with the gulls on it right here. Today the wind is out of a southeasterly direction, and my experience has suggested that the musky, if I'm going to catch a musky off this spot, it's going to be right where those gulls just flew off, right where the wind is first touching that spot. Somewhere on the southeast side where the wind first hits it is where I'm going to catch this fish. Rarely will I catch fish on the back side in this situation. Sometimes you will, but more often than not, the, the percentages work in your favor on the, on the windward side. And, and the reverse will be, be true now. Now if the wind switches, get a cold front that comes through and that wind switches to the northwest and hits that other side, I'm more apt to catch the fish on the left side of this reef. Very simple philosophy, but it works more often than not. Let's give it a shot right now on this and then the upcoming points here and see if I can't catch a fish. Here he comes. Got him. Power release. Mm -hmm. There we go. Now we'll release the free spool. Let him swim out just a little bit here. There we go. Very nice. The ultralight Joe Booker landing net. And like clockwork, that's the way it's done. Figure eight, figure eight, figure eight. I love it, I love it, I love it. Windy point, wind just picked up. Change of direction too, by the way. Hard west wind yesterday, hard southeast wind today. And what happened here is very interesting. It's something we really want to talk about on this particular thing as we let uh, Mr. Muskie kind of collect his thoughts there. Is, uh, is wind angles versus where these fish are in these points. Right now, the, the, a few days ago I caught a fish more on this side when the wind was out of the west. Shift in the wind into the southeast, guess where the fish is? It's on the southeast side of the same point, see? It's just, just you fish the whole thing, but visualize where's the spot where the wind is really touching where that predator has the best advantage. That's usually where they are. The fish was exactly where you were supposed to be. They're not always, you know, set up like that, but more often than not, yes, they are. And again, the fish is laying in, the, in its own live wall right here. Now I can just put my musky mitt on to protect my hands. Pull the fish out. I'll get this rod out of the way so you can, because all I'm going to do is pick this fish up and put it back. All right. I'm just collecting the rest of the landing net to bring the fish closer to me. Yeah. That's real easy to do too. Okay. And then you just get your old musky mitt in there. And sometimes they don't cooperate real good and sometimes they do. There we go. Get a hold of you here. Settle down. I'm gonna put you back. I'm gonna go right over the side with you right here. Back in the water with you right here. There we go. Wow, he just said goodbye. <laughs> so much for that. <laughs> 